Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Tim Rutledge. I'm the President and CEO of Northrop General Hospital. We wanted to hold this press conference uh, to respond to the verdict in the Dr. George Dudenot case that was delivered this morning. I'd like to start by saying that we are proud of the high quality of care and safe care that we provide at North York General. And we take our responsibility to our patients very seriously. The charges against Dr. Dudenot and now his conviction are deeply troubling for all of us at North York General. We know that this trial has been a very long and very difficult process for the patients who came forward, as well as for their families and their friends. We respect the judicial process and the verdict that has been delivered today by Justice McCombs. After an extensive trial, Justice McCombs has ruled that Dr. Dudnot sexually assaulted 20 of our patients while they received care at our hospital. Words cannot begin to describe how sorry I am for the profound impact that these crimes have had on the lives of these patients. We have repeatedly asked ourselves how this could have happened. The sacred bond of caring and trust was broken by a doctor who worked here. That he did this in an operating room, a place of ultimate trust, is difficult to understand and frankly shocking. I want to say to all patients who were assaulted, I deeply regret that you experienced this type of violation. This should not have happened. And on behalf of the hospital, I sincerely apologize. I want to assure you that we have made and will continue to make every effort to ensure that incidents like this never happen again. Continuous learning and ongoing improvement are part of our daily work. We are constantly looking for ways to improve our systems and processes so that we can continue to meet the highest standards of care. When the charges were laid, we took steps to review and strengthen how we address patient complaints. We've installed new software that helps us to document and track what we hear from our patients and enables us to connect incidents that have a similar profile. All serious complaints are now brought to my attention as the CEO, and it is my responsibility to make sure that the right people are involved in the investigations. My goal is that everyone, patients, family, staff, and physicians feels entirely comfortable and safe to come forward with any concerns. To everyone impacted, it is my hope that the verdict in this case will help to bring some measure of closure. We will now take time to study the details of the decision of the judge to determine if there are any other improvements that we can make uh, or any other opportunities to enhance the safety of our hospital. As the leader of this hospital, I am committed to continually learning and improving all aspects of the services we provide. Finally, let me say that I am extremely proud of the North York General Hospital staff, physicians, and volunteers who are committed to providing high quality and safe care every day to our patients. Thank you.